started in 1997, mm -hmm. and uh, our students uh, have uh, been placed at many biotech companies, close to 100% placement, 90-something percent. And uh, uh, biotech is still strong, even though other components of the economy are floundering. Uh, the same number of people get sick and require pharmaceuticals in a bad economy as in a strong economy. And what's nice for us is that the Bay Area dominates. This is the birthplace of biotechnology. The science came out of here. The business side of it came out of here. The first biotech companies were in the San Francisco Bay Area. And still, the San Francisco Bay Area has a larger number of biotech companies than anywhere else in the world. Uh, tonight we're growing cells, and what we've tried to do is to grow cells in the same way that a biotech company would grow cells. These are genetically engineered cells that have had a human gene placed inside of them, and we have tricked these yeast cells to make a human protein, a protein that they're making right now. Uh, as we speak, is uh, human albumin, which is the the most abundant protein in blood. Okay. We have the same equipment that biotech companies have, and it's very expensive, and so our students, when they graduate from our program, have had hands-on experience with the exact machines that they will use on the job. A bioreactor is a chamber that you fill with media, that is, food for your cells, and it bubbles in oxygen at a high rate, it uh, monitors the acidity and then adjusts the acidity, and it monitors the uh, uh, amount of, um, uh, it monitors the temperature, and it adjusts the temperature because cells produce heat, and you have to put cooling water on the outside of the chamber in order to remove that heat. So it gives the cells exactly the right conditions for their maximal growth. And then the cells grow and they produce protein. The protein is human protein and that is the drug. That's the pharmaceutical that ultimately uh, in a biotech company is purified and injected into people. Ultimately uh, our cells will produce protein that then this class will take to purity. They'll go then go through the purification steps of the protein that a biotech company would go through. But what's uh, along the way, they take samples and monitor, and they count the number of cells, and they monitor the growth of the cells and subject the cell. Meet. Many of our students already have bachelor's degrees in biology. Oh, really? They're coming here. To do the biotech. To do biotech and to work with the equipment and gain extra experience. Biotech companies, they hire their starting positions are... Uh, at about 35000 to 40000 a year. That's $18 an hour for high school kids because they don't have any idea of annual salaries. But uh, what biotech companies also do is they pay for additional schooling. So many of our students will get their two-year degree here, get hired by a biotech company, and then the biotech company will give them a full ride through UC Davis and... Uh, Many of our graduates are now in a master's program, and the company is paying for it. And you could go all the way through a Ph.D. program, and the company will pick up the tab.